Hello class of 2023, this is Dr. Bowman, your assistant principal. The final years of high school education represent the last opportunity to learn as many skills as possible and to leave Carter High School with confidence in your ability to succeed. We set the highest expectations for the graduating class of 2023 and encourage all of you to be positive role models for fellow underclassmen. Please be aware that all senior events are a privilege not a right, and come with added responsibility. Carter High School staff and administration believe academic performance should be the number one priority. Consequently, eligibility for senior activities requires that students maintain grades to ensure all credit requirements are met for graduation. Carter administration reserves a right to remove or ban any senior from any senior activity for misconduct and violation of the senior contract. Close attention will be paid to defiant behavior, fighting, plagiarism, cheating, attendance-related issues, document falsification, and behaviors involving alcohol and any other illegal mind-altering substances. Finally, all seniors are expected to maintain positive attendance at all times. Students with absences, truancies, or tardies risk eligibility for senior activities. Consequences of making poor choices can include one or more of the following. Ineligibility for upcoming senior activities, such as grad, grad night, prom, graduation, and site-based activities. Senior privileges removed. Ineligibility removal from prom. Removal from participation in the graduation ceremony. In regard to expectations at senior events, please refer to ROAR responsible, open-minded, ambitious, and respectful. So please come to campus and events with proper attire. Exhibit excellent behavior. Be polite and please no profanity. No alcohol or drugs of any kind and just make good choices. Remember to get your diploma, senior must meet all graduation requirements. Senior dues paid in full. Any student financial obligations are paid. Students must participate in all graduation rehearsals. Students must dress in appropriate graduation attire. Senior contracts signed and returned into admin. Please make sure your laptop is not damaged. Communicate with Gus if there are any concerns with your device during your lunch. Please do not wait until last minute. If a student is not eligible to walk, at commencement, but is eligible for graduation, the student will still be considered a graduate and will receive their diploma with all of the rights and privileges of every other graduate. Please do not jeopardize this once in a lifetime celebration. We accept exemplary behavior for all students, but even more seniors as they are leaders of our school. It is not our goal to remove senior activities but the administration will do so in an effort to uphold the dignity and standards of our Carter community. If you have any questions, please do not hesitate to contact me. Congratulations, class of 2023. I am beyond proud. Good morning, Carter seniors. Man, I always wanted to do that. Hi, I'm Mr. Augustus, your activities director, and I'm here to inform you about some of the upcoming senior events. We have just about two months left, and it seems like just last week, I was able to meet some of you guys during our senior sunrise. It was good times. We had a lot of good times throughout this year. We had our senior nights with the sports, honor roll assemblies, blood drives, and the homecoming dance where I got to see you guys act a little crazy. Now we're at the home stretch. Just two more months, and you guys get to join the club. You'll be adults. So I want to tell you about some of the events. Next Tuesday, we start our prom festivities with our prom court meeting. So if you're interested in running for prom king or queen, come to the ASB room and F104 during your lunch for the instructions on how to win. Remember, that is gonna be next Tuesday. The following Friday, we're gonna have our prom fashion show. That's gonna give you guys some ideas on how to be the flyest in the room. April 28th, that's when we're gonna have our prom rally. You don't wanna miss it. We're gonna have special shows, we're gonna have special performances, and you're gonna to get to see some of our prom court. Follow it the next day on Saturday with our prom in Norco at Silver Lakes. Some things about the prom. If you're bringing a guest, they must be under 20. If they are in high school, they must have a permission slip signed off by their administrators. 
If they're out of high school, they must meet with your senior assistant principal, Dr. Bowman. We're going to follow up our prom with Notre Dame Fiesta. That's going to be our food and dance festival. It's going to be a lot of fun. We're going to have live performances, and we're going to do what you guys love most, our food and giveaways. So make sure you guys are there. In May, we're going to have our senior awards night, senior sunset, grad night, and a bunch of other events for a week that you'll remember for decades to come, and maybe even some for the rest of your life. Our last week of school is also going to be filled with a lot of great events. We'll have senior breakfast, senior luau, with live performances, and to cap it all off, the finale, what we all waited for, graduation. I can't wait to see you guys and your gals. So exciting times are here at Carter High School for our seniors. Let's do it right. Show up to everything and create some of the best memories of your life. Class of 23 here at Carter, I know y'all destined for greatness. So I'm going to see y'all out there. Can't wait to meet you guys, and let's turn up. Hi seniors, uh, we wanted to give you some real quick updates from the counseling office and from our college and career center. Uh, my name is Mr. Wilson, I'm one of the counselors. So the first thing I want you guys to know is we're getting to the end of your senior year. You need to be proactive, okay? So that means like, are you on track for graduation? Do you know? Have you been talking to your counselor? Do you need a zero period or a seventh period? Do you need Apex? If you, um, if you don't know the answer to some of these questions or you're concerned, we're open every day at lunch, before school, after school. We all have email addresses. Reach out to your counselor. Make sure you know what's going on for graduation. Um, speaking about that, Number two, your credits matter, okay? Most of you guys are all on track for graduation, but we're assuming you're going to pass your class the second semester. And we always have students who will fail like one class and not walk. In this district, if you don't pass all the classes that you need for graduation, you do not get to participate in graduation. So please, please, please pass your classes. Your credits matter. Um, if you got accepted to a college, getting a D in a class could make you ineligible. So be really careful not to mess things up as we're in like the final part, okay? All right, Ms. Amori here from the College and Career Center. Just wanna go over some college to-dos. Students, you need to be checking your portals. Um, you don't need to check it every single day, but definitely at least once a week. Make sure you're on top of it. Um, review your award letter. You can find that under the financial aid information. If you have not received your award letter, please contact the school. Um, at this point, we want to see those start rolling in. If you need help reviewing that information, reach out to your counselor, reach out to myself. We are more than happy to go over those with you. In addition, by May 1st, you should have decided where you're going. That's really exciting. So by May 1st, you will also need to pay that deposit. Each school varies in the amount. So keep an eye out for that. And a huge congratulations to Mr. Nguyen's fourth period class. They were the first class to submit. Every single student submitted 100% submission rate. So big shout out to them, congratulations. <laughs> they are going to win a pizza party and we are in the works of planning that. And then a big shout out to all of our seniors because CHS is win we won the district competition against all the other high schools. So we will get an in and out truck. Um, students that are going to be part of this have completed their financial aid application so if you haven't please make sure you get that done or you're not eligible yep and there'll be more information about that from asb soon because i yes. think they're gonna they're gonna combine that with another one of your guys' senior activities okay that's it thanks guys we appreciate it bye hello i am miss cleveland from the library with senior expectations overdue and fine notices have been emailed to seniors Please check your student email to see if you have anything that needs to be turned in or fines that need to be paid. I will email another notice at the beginning of May to follow up. Please turn in textbooks and any devices such as laptops, hotspots, and calculators that you are no longer using to the textbook window before school, after school, or during your lunch. If you have any fines, you can make your payment with Ms. Vargas in the office. Fines must be cleared in order to receive your diploma. If you need assistance, I'm available at the textbook window before school, after school, and during your lunches. <laughs>